Rogerson looking on eagerly. He's got uh, Verag and Schallerer to try to beat. Instead, it goes beyond him to Van Rensburg. Another advantage to Irish are normally so sharp in this area, particularly on those offensive rocks. The rock speed can kill teams, yeah, and it draws penalties. And more than that, Number yellow one. card, quite Number right, one. too. We've Number talked zero. referees about clearing out. That was the second consecutive Number penalty, five. different Number penalty to pulling the line out drive down. And if referees Number feel one. it cynical, which two or three yards away from the line, standing directly behind Paddy Jackson, who's standing directly behind the scrum. Either side of them, two flyers. They're edging towards the left. Another penalty. Ben White. Oh, Ben White goes quickly. Stay back. Leave it. Stay back. Creevy digging for the ball. So too Rob Simmons. Juan Martin Gonzalez over the line and scores. First Champions Cup, Heineken Champions Cup try that Irish have scored for 10 years. White, Jackson. Real speed about what Irish are about at the moment. Van Rensburg again and Hassel Collins. And Hassel Collins on his own drives through. Thought about giving the ball away. Van Rensburg and the passage just blocked. But what a moment this. Picked up by Creevy. Try scored. Lucio Sinti warming everyone's toes up on a chilly night in West London. What a try that was. And what a yellow card that is for Montpellier, London Irish, helping themselves full, full advantage, and really it came from the hard running and the wonderful work there of Gonzalez at the line out against the head so the defence is not set and Hassel Collins fills his boots, look at that, gets on the outside of Amosa and look at the leg drive through contact, after contact, two or three players on him. Okay. Yeah, Topsy, really good work from the London Irish winger. Yeah, it's a brilliant score, but great play by the team all round because they took Montpellier all the way to one sideline and then going wide, wide, so you could see. Back line just weren't set up for it. Control that. The corner will do it. Okay, Mateo, come back with me, please. Yeah, on the referee, please. Screen the referee, yeah. Just hey. Yeah, I think I saw, saw the, the image on the screen. For me, it's a high level of danger. Number two, never try to wrap. He's usually only his shoulder. It's the right contact with the head. No mitigation for us. It's a red card against number two. Mitigation is the No, no, he never changed. He, he never changed. He never changed height. That's for me. And he was always illegal. So I don't want to use any mitigation. Number two, please. Well, there are good reasons why these red cards are given. Mitigation. You use your shoulder, never try to wrap. I don't see any changes in height of the of the of that player. No, it's for me. It's a, it was a red card. It's Rogerson outstretched arm, trying to fend off Beckonyi. In the tackle, Vantage, uh, ball didn't go ball. forwards, and this is Loder skipping through real opportunities. Gonzalez, a man down, no problem. Gonzalez with his second of the night, Irish with the third. Well, this is good hard running from Mateo. Ben Loder, isn't it? And great support play. I'll tell you what. He seems to have uh, run off that shoulder problem. I think they had penalty advantage or knock-on advantage anyway. And sometimes when the ball goes to ground, their defences just struggle. Look, they've got short numbers on that. Little short side, good spot from Ben White. Ball doesn't quite go to hand, but Ben Loder is the first one to react. How about this? Just falls into him. Lovely little step ten, off his ten, left foot. Ten. And just too much speed. And the awareness tops just to connect back on the outside with Gonzalez. Lost his feet. And he has the, uh, he'll need some support here. And he finds it with Reinach, who finds Mercer. Oh, and that's brilliant. Schallera hit back, but it's Reinach who goes through and Reinach scores. To Lamb, who invites Boutier to um, go on a little shuttle. Oh, he does more than that. He makes brilliant ground. Anthony Boutier. 
going to have a chat with uh, Bruce Ray Harner down on the coaching benches in a moment. The Montpellier benches. Meantime, Bruce watching where this attack's going and Reinach finding Carbonell and this is Dama and they score. And both sides warming their hands this evening. That's another cracker. Well, that's by far the best piece of play we've seen from Montpellier this evening, and it's just typical that offloading out of contact, almost off the floor on occasions if the tackle is not held, perfectly entitled to offload. Some really, really good play here. All came from the skipper, Boutier, who made that burst through contact. Look, two men to bring him down. And how about that little short pop pass? Look at this. Man goes down, and it's this offload off the floor. Nothing wrong with that. And Reinach spots that space on the outside. Simple straightening of lines. Well, again, the speed of ball from Montpellier. Initially, that Boutier carry gets them on the front foot, and the ball is just in and out of the ruts in no time. The Irish defence have no time to set. It's simple hands. They miss one a couple of minutes ago. They get it this time. Coley. For how much longer? Maybe for not much longer. Beck on ye. It was coming. And Irish down on numbers and holes beginning to be exposed. Yeah, I just think they wore them down, didn't they? Nine phases later. I think missing touch might have proved quite costly there. Because it all came from that. And they launched that attack. Again, the skipper to the four, Boutier. But every single carry seemed to be getting them over that advantage line. And I just wonder, Tops, whether all of that tackling, particularly in the last 10 or 15 minutes, is starting to take its toll on London Irish because the carry's got more and more progressive. Mercer with the footwork. Mercer looking to take on Oliver Hoskins in a head-to-head. -head. And then the drive for the line. Very nearly there. Over the top. Try scored. Thomas Darbon with his second and Darmo and Montpellier just beginning to pull away. Yeah, it's a patient and excellently worked try. I've got to say that the effect of Mercer again and Beconi, I think the eight and the seven for Montpellier. It's done brilliantly there. Darmon to keep the ball in play. And gets in over the line field, aren't they? They get in there. Simmons lays it back. Marisi. Jennings. Oh, it has gone forwards. Knock on. Oh, it was knocked on. on. And that's the end. And the curtain falls on opening night. And it falls with Montpellier ahead. A, a game that seemed to turn on Agustin Creevy's red card. Even then, Irish found themselves 24-6 ahead. But then the decision to kick to touch with just a few seconds left at the end of that first period really costing Irish.